6.4 is one of the latest releases of Fortinet and they're doing a great job from release to release adding new features and up until now there were dozens of videos all over describing the new features of 6.4. Well, I've decided to create one that will focus on the more friendly features of 6.4. So let's start. The first feature, friendly feature, is the execute speed test that you can do on your WAN interface. To do so, you'll have to have the um, SD1 network monitor license. Once you have one, you can jump up to your WAN interface and execute a speed test. Now, when you do so, the results will be added to your estimated bandwidth, the estimated WAN bandwidth, but you will have to be connected to FortiGuard and to, I believe, Google's or AWS speed test servers. The second friendly feature is a fantastic one. I've been always asked when dealing with security profiles, which feature is supported either in flow-based inspection mode or in proxy-based inspection mode? And it seems that you, up until 6.4, you had to remember which feature is supported and where. So from now, you can actually create a new security profile. And if you wish to see which feature or which um, capability is supported under the proxy inspection mode the only thing that you need to do is to click on the proxy base and there you will see that you can only use content disarm and reconstruction under the proxy based mode the same goes to web filter just click on the proxy base and you will see the features that are supported only on a proxy-based inspection mode. The next friendly feature is actually not a feature. It is a way of describing things much more clearly. So when you go to a network, SD-WAN, and you add up new interfaces to be part of the SD-WAN interface, and the next thing is to create an SLA, a performance SLA, where you uh, configure the SLA uh, server and the SLA target. The next thing is to go to SD-WAN rules. Now in SD-WAN rules at the end you actually create your SD-WAN strategy. The SD-WAN strategy can be manual, best quality, maximized bandwidth and lowest cost. I can tell you that every student uh, ask me what does it mean what is best quality what is maximized bandwidth so finally Fortinet actually describes each strategy and what it does the next friendly feature is a cool feature which is the ip address tooltip whenever you hover with your mouse over an ip address it will show up more information on that ip address so let's go to login report and application control and let's see what happens when we hover towards that IP address. Well, we can see that the owner is Google. We can see the location, which is England. We can also see the latitude, longitude, and the running services. Let's go to another IP address. And that IP address also is owned by Google. Let's find uh, an IP address which may not be owned by Google. All right, so we have an IP address that the owner is Amazon, and it seems as the local CDN here in Israel, Tel Aviv. Another friendly feature is the Add Widget, which is now much more organized than it was before. 
you have dozens of widgets some of them are new i believe that the ipsec and the ssl vpn widgets are new and you have a bunch of wi-fi widgets that shows you the channel utilization of the access point clients per access point interfering access points and so on and the last friendly feature is the fact that you now don't have an ipv4 policy and an ipv6 policy you only have a firewall policy you can add up an ipv6 or an ipv4 address object to be added to the source and destination fields in your one policy